Well, let me tell you about the time that I got lost in a forest. The journey begins with transport, trying to get to Beckham. <laughs> I'm going to a party down a falling apart road, which is why the camera shakes every step. This is what I'm heading into. Now, I don't know what's there, but all the houses in the area are really nice. There's trees and greenery, and I'm not even sure if this is the right road, but I thought I would film some of this little journey, because there's like nature, trees, there's automatic gates. Look, here's a tree. I touched it. I'm a badass. I'm really hoping that it's not hay fever that keeps on making me ill because if so, walking into the middle of a forest in the evening to drink alcohol in the cold, probably not the best of ideas. But I've made worse decisions over the time, so I think of what's the worst that can happen. Let's wander into this dark, not slightly intimidating forest. As I'm being chased by a car, you can see it back there, driving very politely, um, but stalking me nonetheless. I survived the first vehicle of this. The uh, Fox Grove involves being under here. It's a golf course right there. Right there, like, and then there's just trees over my head. The path splits in two. Do I go that way or do I go that way? I saw a car go this way, so. Suffice to say, I stopped using Google. Actually, I'm gonna look in here. I stopped using Google Maps for directions so that I could film this. There's a bench. Welcome to me live vlogging the death of John Barker. And now I'm wandering up a different path, which may not lead anywhere near where I want to be going. This is only about 7 p.m. Everyone else is going to watch the Eurovision. I'm going to get killed in the forest. So we will know who's winning that one. And it's not the Eurovision people. Not going to lie, I expected to see a building by now. It's meant to be a pub or something. All I'm seeing are little fences and mud, lots of mud. Maybe I'll go onto Google Maps for a second just so I don't get completely lost. Google Maps says it's just around the corner, which is exciting. Um, there's only about half an hour to an hour's worth of daylight left and it might rain. So those birds don't want me here. Is that? Don't really know what that's meant to do. It's not going to stop me, is it? It's it's tiny. It's not going to stop water from flowing through either because it's made of branches. It's a pretty crap nest, really. Don't know what it's meant for. Oh, it's a signpost. Let's uh, let's use this green chain walk. No, nope. That's not what I want. Uh, green chain walk. Green chain walk. Capital ring. None of those. Let's walk off the beaten path through some more trees so I'm not really dressed for this not really sure that this was the best way I could come to here but The colours and everything today are incredible. It's like so vibrant and green and lush and... Is there an exit here? There's kind of an established path going underneath branches and things. See? Hoping that this is a path that's walked by people and not by wolves because that'd be a bit shit. Not gonna lie, I feel like I'm in a Legends of Zelda game at the moment.
Right, so that's useless. You know how in horror films people will split up, go separate ways, and then the white kid dies and everyone's like, oh, but he was a good person. And you're like, no, he was an idiot. Why'd he split up from the group? Currently, that's me. I've already forgotten which which of these paths I chose as my route through, so that's fun. Let's get back to the main bit. <laughs> 